All right, so it's kind of ironic. I actually had a uh, elastic on my water bottle, which uh, if I ever, if I always have a spare elastic, I always put on a water bottle. Something I've been doing since I was in Army Cadets. <coughs> so what I did, I uh, huh, wrapped around my housing for my mic adapter and stuck it on the actual uh, piece of hold, my actual mic ad mic into the adapter so this right here won't fall out again it's kind of a, a cheap fix for a uh, long term solution I will get some black elastics because this here will, I like to have matching gears so right now it is what it is it works before what it is man, it's a lot of, man I love when it's warmer out the battery works okay so either we go forward See, that's the thing. If I go through that bush, I don't know who's there. Or I take the bike path back to the complex. Which is probably busy because it's a beautiful day. Decisions, decisions. And how do I avoid traffic areas? If I go that way, I won't be able to. If I go this way, it should be good. So, I love how today's video turned out to be a little adventure. That's why I say, subscribe, because you never know what we get into on the channel. Never, yeah. This way here, you guys don't know what we ever get into on the channel. Right now, we're turning to a little adventure. So, it's the pretty much... Hey, squirrel! Hey, little dude! So, right now, we're just heading the bike path, and we're going to be going to the complex. It's still, it's still early spring. Everything's still opening up. So we just gotta be careful with that. <clears throat> so is get some nice long footage in. Sit back and enjoy. And I'll put my lens down because I don't feel like eating any damn bugs. Well, I'm actually, you know what? I'm just gonna stop here quickly. My mirror, I'm gonna have to fix it again. This is why I installed a bike path bell on my bike. Of course, if there's too many people on the bike path, I'm getting off it. So I'm on the bike path, I'm not gonna be going faster than 20 kilometers an hour. I've been on this path before with this bike. Uh, with the Yellow Zone, no, but with my old VT GT I have. With the bigger e-bikes, you get a bit more looks because people don't know what they are. Because they look like actual motorcycles. And these ones here are actually more common in my town because of their size. Okay, they're walking there. What the hell's burning stuff? So this is the little adventure of one of my local bike paths. Getting that look confused. Believe me, if this was an actual motorcycle, I would not be on the bike path with it. I got so much bug goo on the inside and outside of my freaking lamp visor. It's not even funny. So that's another thing too with early spring riding. The city hasn't really come out yet with their machines to clean out the bike path. So there's going to be extremely cautious too with debris and all that on the bike path. So I got wider tires on this. So I'm not really worried about it. I can cover more ground. It's just when people who are actually cyclists, either the three-wheeled or two-wheeled kind of bikes, they have to be extremely careful because your tires are a lot thinner. Oh, that's beautiful down there. Nice and cool near the water. Yeah, go 
coming down something like this. Like they really should have a barricade right here because someone loses control, they're going they're going into the water. <clears throat> Especially don't man. This I remember these paths being built. And I've been down these paths more time I can shake a stick at. Especially out here. I used to live in Glen Walter as a teenager. I used to take his bus pass back and forth to work every day on my bike. Well, let's hit something really hard. I'm looking at cycles. Okay, somebody's here walking or on a bike. Yeah, on a bike. Okay, don't look at me. Fucking pay attention to what you're doing there, dude. A motorcycle guy just staring me down. Like, I'm uh, you want to pay attention to what is in front of you? This is slow. I hate these bushes and I don't know what was behind them. Usually I just blast my horn. Well, I thought they'd be a lot better, worse shape than this, but I guess not. And this is why I call the channel Electric Junkies Adventures, because we're always on an adventure. I guess someone dropped a glove. Excuse me. So, in my local town, the bikes are allowed on the bike path, but they're not allowed in the park where the civic complex is, and up in that area where the play structures are. If you're from my local town, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. That's the area you're not allowed with an e-bike. <coughs> Everything else is fair game. So there's no bylaw saying I cannot be on the bike path. Yes, I'm allowed to. See, this is where I don't. This is where I. One reason why I don't like being on the bike path with my bikes because I have to go past uh, little critters, and then if the little critter gets scared, they bark and they try to chase you. I know I have a little critter at home. I'm gonna pass this guy. So I even have a little like a bell on this. I don't like even then with the dogs around. I don't like using it because it scares them. Like you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't, you know what I mean? Ooh, a charger. Is that a challenger? Oh nice. That's the real ones, not the plastic ones you buy in the toy box. Buy for the toy box. See, right now I'm going about 17 to 20 clicks. I'm not going stupid fast. <clears throat> Those guys clean up this area.
It is a nice day. It was supposed to rain all day, but I guess not. It was supposed to rain tonight, though. So, oh, look at that. It's a police cruiser ahead of me. Huh. This should be interesting. See, I modified my bike aesthetically to look like an actual motorcycle. So, let's see what he's... Oh, no, it's not. Okay, I thought it was a copper. <coughs> So let's take a look, like a little 125, so people just don't understand until they see the plate and pedals. I really should invest in one of those uh, Atlas things. Gonna have to go look for one. Okay, so now where this is going to take us is right behind all the little subdivision right there and behind one of our local high schools. I don't know if I'll be able to get down to the complex by the other, this other area because I think a lot of it is blocked off. <laughs> I'm about to find out. I'm gonna have to go take a side street and go down. Ow. It's open so I guess we can go down there. Beware blind spot head slow down. You don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> Hey, birdie. Yeah, you tell me that when I was 16 years old, I come around that corner like a battle freaking hell. And some more flowers. Ooh, that talks in better days. Hey, Robin. I get that feeling back in my hand. I want to open my visor, but since it's near the river, all well, those little black bugs are out right now. It's about June. You know, there's a local high school. <laughs> this could use a paint job. See, they put this path in when I was a kid. Then they don't really. I don't want to say maintain it, but they don't really. I want to say maybe put more paint on the lines would be great. <laughs> okay, I know I can get through here, but I want to make sure there's nobody around. I don't like doing that. Okay, so here we go. Where do they put those on? Through here, slow. I gotta crack that. I can't freaking breathe. And this is part of the old locks. I think that may have been the entrance. I don't remember. This summer, I plan on revisiting the uh, Cornwall Locks tour, but we're going to be going further than the Power Dam. Break. I think I'm back 
fucking path. Don't want to stay here too long because the college is very alien intended. If you don't have a parking pass, the rent the mall cop will come out and fucking tell you. <laughs> yeah, this is what I mean about May 18. What if I could hit the bike path? I'll keep going. So that's a little, that's a kid's like ADCC bike, dirt bike, and they're driving on the bike path with it, which is hella illegal. And there's two people on it. And people think these are actual freaking problems, they're not. I still do have all my lights on for safety though. Fucking idiots. Fucking idiots. Okay, am I able to get around this? Do I have to go back up the street? I'll get around that, no problem. They actually widened it. So I am not going down that way. I'll go down this way. So all I'm doing now is just detouring the bike path. I guess I, I cleaned my brake pads, so I don't know why they're squeaking so much for Fucking don't do it. What the hell happened down here? Here's the old Carmel Harbor, what's left of it. It's where that building down thing like last year, I believe. I'm just gonna stop here and get some water. We'll be back on the road. Okay, so we're back. I just stopped at the big local harbor. It looks nice and pretty. Change out the battery. As like I said, when you film at 4K, the batteries don't last long. It went down to like 50, 59% when I checked it and it started dropping like one, like two, three points, so. I just changed it out anyways, threw it in my battery bank charger and right now that's charging. Kind of happy I spent money on that. 
it was, like, it was expensive though. I think it was like sixty bucks for that damn thing. I couldn't find it cheaper anywhere else. But for what I wanted to do with it, it's worth the investment. Ten thousand four hundred million power bank. And if I had to, I was plug it into an actual power bank, which I didn't take one with me because. Uh, I don't think I need it. I didn't think I'd be going on an adventure either, so. That's why I say subscribe, stick around, because you never know what kind of stuff we get into over here. There's a lot of people out today, I said, wouldn't actually expect that. Uh, we got a Corvette right here. There's nobody behind me. I'm gonna go down here, so let's go down, down here. Uh, she obviously didn't look where she was fucking going. Oh, I well, guess baseball started up. That was baseball practice. Uh. I'm still getting over that damn cold or virus, whatever the hell I had. Slowly going away, but it's going away. This way. Whoa, man, why is that still sticking on the ground like that? I could take out somebody's tire. Oh, it belongs to the baseball field. Okay, I didn't know that. So, this is the first time I'm, I'm ever doing this. I'm gonna go up this hill and down to the complex because it just bypasses all that street. <laughs> I'll try to get to that part now. Oh, hopefully I can make it up there. This lady go. Yeah, they're cleaning everything up. Everything's gonna be open soon. I think I think, I think everything opens May long weekend or sometime in May. I'm not sure. Can't wait. I think everyone is tired of winter and all this cold. Oh jeez! Wow, am I glad I have my lens covered? Lens closed. Too nice a day to stay at home. Everybody else is off at birthday parties and whatnot, and well, I'm like, screw it, I'll go and record a nice long video for my viewers. Okay, there's a sidewalk, I'm gonna go down the sidewalk, so I'll go follow the path and I'll get off. Actually, no, I'll go behind the complex. See, I don't know if I'll drop this video in two parts because it's probably going to be over an hour long. So, waiting another week, I'll probably drop it on a Wednesday. Normally, I'll drop a video once per week, but since the nicer weather's coming and I'll be doing a lot more traveling, I'll probably be dropping a next one every now and again on a Wednesday. But normally, it'll be once a week. You can tell the temperature change from the water. What the heck is oh is that the farmer's market? 
What's going on down here this weekend? I need to see any advertising. Oh, it's Earth Day. That's why. Or Eco Day, wherever it is. See, this is the area where you're not allowed to take your e-bike. So you are over here. So I'm going to have to use this way to get back around. Yeah, so you can get idiots like this. I heard a few people say a few things about the e-bikes on the bike path. Don't really care. At least I can stay on my own side of the lane. Let's just gotta go first. We're going to have to stop. Oh my god, man, what the hell happened over here? This is bad. Wow, this is really bad. Parking lot's awful. I think today's Eco Day or Earth Day or some shit, I don't know. I didn't see anything on Facebook, whatever. So I'm just gonna take the streets all the way back home. Just to avoid all the people. But I am gonna go down this bike path though. I'm going to plug this battery in too for the week. Ouch. Man, these roads are horrible. I just gotta figure out what street I gotta take. <laughs> wow, man. And I'm the fucking problem. Fucking lunatic. That's the guy that freaking gave me a freaking smug look earlier. Pulls out front of me and looks at me like I'm the bad guy. Seriously. Nothing, nothing. <clears throat> oh, you gonna do it, lady?
So what I'm just going to do right now, I'm just going to head the bike path back up. You know what, I'm going to go up this way. Oh, it's just a fun part because I need to go straight. And I can't see Jack. How's it going to here? So there we go guys, we'll cut the video off there. See you guys in the next one.